This was a South Carolina specific grant program for nonprofits and emergency management organizations to respond to emergency situations. And in Anderson, Oconee, and Pickens, there were three, Anderson County, Oconee County Emergency Management, and also the City of Pickens Fire Department. We have noticed that a lot of our emergency management folks could use a little extra help, so Duke Energy put aside $500,000 for grants for nonprofits and emergency management organizations so that they can purchase the equipment or anything that they need to help them to respond better. So the plan is, is to give that back to the community and the way we're giving that back to the community is through helping the community be prepared. Uh, by doing that we're providing weather radios, but it's not just a weather radio. It's going to be a FM radio, AM radio, weather radio, charging station, flashlight, and it's going to be powered by solar or by hand crank. So even the event of the, the worst emergency, even if we don't have power, we still have ways of getting the communications to the public about what's going on and what steps to take to prepare yourself. So our plan is, is to use our first responders, whether that be fire, law, EMS, to actually get these units out to the public. This way we can kind of spread it out evenly because we're not gonna have enough grant money to actually give one out to every single person. So we're gonna try to do as many, um, at least one per household as much as we can do, but we know that we're not gonna be able to provide one per person. So we're gonna get as many out to the community as we can to just help people be prepared. In the event that a storm comes through or you see some bad weather coming in and you hear it from our meteorologist, you can take this unit, pull it out, and start listening to the weather, weather announcements. Uh, you're gonna get any weather warnings on it. You'll get updated weather information. Um, you can also have it on FM or AM radio and start listening to that. If your power goes out, you can use it to charge your phone. I know we all have radar apps on our phone. We all have weather apps on our phone to keep us updated. So this is a good way to just keep you powered up even if the power is off. We have worked with Duke Energy in the past on other grants and we have always been a good steward of their money and they have always been a good steward to us and we've got a really good working relationship and we just appreciate Duke accepting our grant application and allowing us to go forth and help our community.